Right now I'm on the GoPro Quick app so that I can use it on Final Cut Pro. This video begins like so many golf instructional video begins. I dub it, Welcome to the Jungle, because we're all trapped in a jungle of swing thoughts and tips and pointers that may or may not work. A lot of us out there, when we want to improve our game, go right to YouTube. There are tons of good golf channels with great instructional videos. Today, I'm gonna to focus on top speed golf with my southern brother from another mother, Clay Ballard. I watched a few of his videos, and I think it really helped smooth my swing out. I'm gonna show you me applying his instructional videos to my golf swing, and then I'm gonna give it a thumbs up or thumbs down. Stay tuned. Again, this is my first video with the GoPro camera. So I'm working the tripod. I bought this GoPro a year ago. It's been sitting around in my house for about 10 months, but now I'm ready to put this baby to use just as they released the next version of the GoPro, the GoPro 10. So again, this is just the GoPro 9. And now you can see here, swing is starting to look like it has a little bit of flow to it, isn't it? I'm gonna post the YouTube golf instructional videos that I watched before this range session that I think are taking my swing and my swing thoughts to the next level. So you can see here, the one video, you wanna feel like if with the heel down a little bit more, it helps the golf club release naturally. That's why I stared into the camera and did that left-handed swing. That is a very juicy looking and ball striking sounding swing. I look back at the camera to nod in satisfaction to myself. Yes, and that's all a result of feeling like on these swings that I've got the toe up in the little, a little bit in the air address and the heel is more on the ground and I'm trying to swing through the ball with the heel lower at impact. It's really helping me get through the ball and as you can hear from the sound, the ball's really taken off. Now this part, I'm trying to feel like the golf club head is climbing a wall I'll also show you that segment of that video. All right, you can tell from the sound, I did not catch that one flush. I hit it very thin, but that's what happens First when you're working no with new wrong. swing keys and swing drills and swing thoughts. But that feeling that the club face is climbing a wall keeps the club going out towards the target rather than pulling it left. And that was flush. So you know what? I'm back. Again, did you hear that sound? How crisp it was? It sounded like they've already released Top Gun 2 into the movie theaters. That was a MIG. the GoPro.
Now I'm gonna go over the main points from these top speed golf videos that I've emphasized today while in the small screen you see me playing Perfect Swing. The Perfect Swing app is the best way to build your golf game knowledge. In some way, somehow, you should download this. The link is in the profile to download Perfect Swing. Let's get into the lesson. The first point was that to shallow your golf swing, you want to feel like the heel of the club is lowered address, and when you come into the ball, you also keep the heel low so that you can see here, the shaft never gets steep. By keeping the heel low, the shaft comes in very shallow. I know Clay in the video, his actual video, he uses the same, you know, a pane of glass image that Ben Hogan made popular way back in the day. And now the second part of the swing session I put on the range involves the idea that the golf head is climbing a wall. And that's best emphasized by this little ball thing here. If I swing and I feel like that head of my club is climbing up a wall, you can see that the ball comes down from the base of the grip. Usually, a lot of the lessons focus on not having this part of the golf club hit you until after you, until after you hit the ball. However, what was unique about this what was unique about this lesson was the fact that not only do you not have this part of the club hit your body as you're com coming into impact, but if you want that ball to climb the wall, it actually never hits your body. Again, conventional, I've seen this drill many times. Oh, you hit the ball, it doesn't hit your body until after the ball. No, now I'm gonna always think, it never hits your body. And let's try it with the ball, golf ball here. I'm gonna feel like this is out here. Great swing training aid. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is your lesson for today. Just when you thought the video was over, I'm gonna throw a little smack talk out. This Sunday I'm playing Cowboy Rob again. I've beaten him four times in a row. And then the last time we played, we tied because he made a miraculous par and then a closing hole birdie to again just tie me. So he hasn't beaten me in five matches and I intend to get on another winning streak this Sunday. Tune in later to find out what happens.